in today's video we are looking at how you can automate your content creation process by using gpt3 stable diffusion and python so this could be any type of content it could be an article for a website it could be a blog post it could be a social media post it could be a youtube or a podcast script but anyway this is up to you now let's just get started okay so the article we are gonna write today is about the strange benefits of the soleus push-up this is going to be for a makeup health website so i think we just start the timer now and see how long this will take us what i always start with is in this workflow i always fire up um, stable diffusion time is going so while i am setting up this uh stable diffusion model i always try to get my research stuff Okay, so now I'm just going to open my Python script. I hope you can see this. All right. Yeah, I think that should be fine. Okay, so here are my two scripts. One is uh, write the post. And the other script is for social media. So this is going to be where I put all my research. What I got from the, the paper. So that should be it. Now our script is actually ready to do. So I have made it. So the only things I have to do is just feed it... Uh, my research stuff cd python uh, cd i think it's uh workflow can't really remember python uh is it bright post so let me just run this script i think i have some prints here so we can watch what happens so basically what i want is five questions from the the research material and i want to answer those questions and i want to elaborate on those questions so that's a very good foundation for um, for my article okay now the script has run so i'm just gonna copy that paste my questions answers copy those of course, is this if this was going to be a published article, I would have... Uh, so now I have the foundation. I would have added more down here. Let's go back here. Okay, so this is finished. Okay, so here we have the prompt we want to use. I actually have like a very uh, standard prompt that works pretty well with images in Stable Diffusion. So that is going to be this prompt. I'm going to copy this now. So this is the one I usually use. This is an article about a leg or like a heel lift. Strong human heel and calf maybe lifted off the ground. So I usually do this in between the social media. So I get this started. Okay, so now I can hit save. Copy the title. And the rest of the article. Go back to my script. Now it's a new script. This is my social media script. Here we got uh, our article so far without the introduction and uh, conclusion. Python. Right. So me. Hi. Okay, let me try this. So this hopefully is going to make a tweet and an email with a subject line. That looks okay. Here's our tweet. You can see this now. The soulless muscle is a key player in walking, running, standing. Check out the new exercise taking the fitness world by storm. There's no hashtags, so I guess I had to add that myself. Uh, because I haven't fine tuned the model yet. But that's okay. Sounds like a tweet. Let's check the email. So this is probably going to be the subject line then, I think. And here are, I guess it's just a summary. So this looks good. So that's our article, tweet, and uh, email ready to go. Okay, I think that's good enough. Of course, you could spend much more time on it. And you probably should. I actually think I'm just going to do the conclusion. GPT-3 now. Go to the playground. 
I usually write the conclusion myself, but I'm a bit lazy now. Right, and engaging conclusion from the following text. This in here. Just read over this. Sounds good. Okay. Let's grab the introduction. Copy that. Boom. Go grab the conclusion. Okay. So this is looking good. So let's push up. I think this one is okay. Write some matching hashtags for the following. Wait. Okay, leave it like this. Then we of course want to add our article here. We can now look at that later. Because we want a featured image. And I guess we want a couple of images in between here. Okay, this one was quite good. I was not. That's perfect. I actually think that would have been better for the featured image. Save. And preview this. I think this is better. Yeah, this is much better. It's still quite uh, gross. You get the point. So here it is. That's not too bad. We got the link to our post, so I'm quite happy with that. I guess we can just go with this one. Uh, update. That should be it. Have a look at the final article. We got our featured image, title, introduction. What is the solo marshal? What is the solo push-ups? How do you perform it? What are the benefits? What are the researchers saying? And the conclusion. So yeah. I think this worked out pretty good. We are about 37 minutes. Of course, this is could be improved a lot. With some preparation. 37 minutes, 34 seconds. It's not too bad. Okay, okay. Let's do one more thing. We gotta check how much this cost us. Okay, so we spent 96 cents on this article. We did 59 requests. 96 cents for that one. So I would say it's free. 37 minutes. Images from Stable Diffusion. That's free. Use the Google Colab. Open AI. API. 96 cents. Let's say one dollar then. One dollar. That's not bad for a article. Anyway, I'm not gonna stall this out more. Uh, I think this worked out good. And yeah, happy days.